Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. This is another Archland video. Um, today we're just going to do a gameplay. Um, you know, I finally got to level um, 41. So I'm able to continue the story. Um, I also just pulled Catherine. Um, there has been an update not too long ago. A patch update where you get Catherine and Siegfried now on Raid Up. Um, I was able to pull um, um, Catherine. Um, actually pretty crazy uh, because I got it from a single summon although I did a 10 pull first but then I got it from a single summon so I'll put that somewhere in the video just to uh, show those pulls um, but I'm gonna test Catherine right now Catherine is a dark unit um, mage um, based on her skills she specializes a lot in debuffing um, her trait um, is when two allies, <coughs> when an ally is within two tiles of Catherine, um, uses an active skill, she will grant ally um, increased damage pretty much. Um, some of this stuff isn't translated here. She can also summon um, creatures next to her, which you can use them to attack and to defend. Um, the way I have her built now, I took her. I went to the bo bottom path, so she has. Um, Silent magics, you can silent the enemy for uh, two turns. That basically means that they can't use their skills, only basic attacks. Um, I don't know if the translation is right, but Rubber of the Shadow, it increases um, one ally. You get solid armor, so physical defense plus 20%. Um, <clears throat> I know it does something else also, but and there's also this, which is physical attack. Physical depends was 20, but anyways, um, just know that she's like a great debuffer from from all the skills that I've seen. Let's just test her out and see how she works. Um, so she's a dark unit. I think one of my first SSR dark units that I have. Can't remember if there's another one, but actually no, I, I'm lying. We have um, this character right here, which I'm I'm not really using. Don't really not as powerful as you know should be. But anyways, let's just go ahead and jump into it and see what this character can do. Um, so let's just see. Um, hopefully this is nothing tricky where we have to actually um, do much. So let's see. Alright, so I'm going to use the skill and see what it does to my... Um, what it does to my Charlotte. So we're going to activate the skill. We're going to give it to Charlotte. Okay. Now let's take a look and see what. <coughs> oh, and it spawned a monster too, so it spawned a shadow line. So you activate the skill and spawn a shadow line. So I am gonna. I am gonna put the shadow line right here and pretty much put it in protection mode. Oh, for Charlotte, okay, she has the attack plus one. Physical attack plus one, uh, plus sorry, plus twenty percent. Um, magic attack plus twenty percent. That's for three turns, and she has the solid armor, so physical uh, defense plus twenty. And then obviously we already still have the protection from um, Gabriel, the, the tank. Um, so there's that. All right. So I am gonna go ahead and attack. <clears throat> using this skill right here all right hopefully I can get a second at, I can get a second turn perfect for the second turn I like to use um, late bloomer first okay Full kill, but it will die because the extra turn. Right. <clears throat> can I get another turn now? Let's see if it can. No? Okay. No problem. Alright, so I am gonna just use semi to take out this unit right here. I won't attack the bosses yet. I'll probably use Gabriel to attack the boss. expecting to 
kill in one hit, but I guess not. Okay. <clears throat> so, I'm going to use Gabriel to attack the boss. Um, and just in case anything was to happen to Semi, I'm going to move. Probably should move the tank up a little bit closer. Don't die, please. Thank you. Okay. Kind of messed up there, but that's fine. Alright. So. So let's activate this. I am gonna use this guy just to take out. Oh, shouldn't have done that. I should have exploded, but whatever. Um, I'm going to try to sil silence the boss, can I? Okay. And I'm not too worried about it just because I'm I'm going to I'm going to heal myself up, so I'm not too worried about it. I did make a misplay. I probably should have um <coughs> That unhealable, interesting. Okay, interesting. That's funny, guys. That is very funny. So he's not gonna be able to attack um, Semi because Semi's skill is gonna allow her to dodge. So I'm not too worried. Um, I am, however, concerned about, um, I am, okay, perfect, that's what I was worried about, but protection there. Okay. Perfect, that's what I was concerned about. Okay, perfect, that's also what I was concerned about. Good. Okay. Now it's my turn. Now do I have um is that status effect gone off of me? Perfect, it's gone off of me. Just as safety. Um this is a safety precaution. I'm gonna go ahead and heal. I don't wanna um normally I'd probably try to use that last, but let's just do that now. the assist skill um, that um, she has <coughs> this one right here I believe this is the one that we used yeah so that's what that was okay so that's the, the skill grant li lively t lively I don't think the two is there like I said the translation might be off but that was that um, okay come on 
do some damage. So if I come here, I should be in the effect of the skill. So I won't be in the effect of this skill, which kind of... Well, can I... Yeah, let's do it. If I move him over here, have him self-destruct. Okay, perfect. So if I do that, if I move... One thing with Catherine, she has low uh, defense. She doesn't have very high defense, so that's itself a problem. And then I'm back to the same issue which I had where I wanted to have um, semi stand in the buff, the spot with a buff, but that's not gonna work. Alright, no, doesn't matter. No, oh, she's, she still gets a buff? I didn't realize that. Maybe she's standing there, I didn't see. So someone's gonna die because my turn's gonna end. I don't have enough. Um... Okay, perfect. I'll take that. Okay, I'll take that. Um... So I'm gonna use that healing skill. It should. Because I have the um, the weapon for a fairy, th that should give me the, the buff across, okay. Um, let's attack. Nice damage, buff. Don't tell me I just wasted that. Misfortune. Unable to dodge, do extra attack, I do double. <laughs> oh man, really? Uh, come on. Alright, whatever. Okay. Alright, not, not a tough fight or anything. Um, like I said, a different team. I, nev I normally don't use Catherine in my team out of use um, Linda or, I'm sorry, Lena or um, out of use Lena or um, the, uh, my other mage, um, Lena or Nola, so I can get the buff for um, Gabriel. But uh, Catherine works really well. Um, I'll show you what gear and stuff I have on her right now. Like I said, just pulled her, so not full there yet. But as you can see, uh, silent using silent magic, and that's just the skill that silence the the enemy. I'm using the rubber of shadow, so you get the physical defense. Um, and then this, you get this attack if um, when it summons the minion to come out. This is this passive skill that I'm also using, called the Touch of Death. Um, if you use your skills for this turn, um, I guess 
again, this is weird, I don't know the translation, but it has to do with debuffing, I'm going to try to figure out the translation so I can, um, you know, have a little bit more accurate information on that. I chose to go the bottom route just because I wanted to get this skill right here, which is unhealable. I could see this coming in very handy on some bosses, so I chose to take the bottom route. Um, obviously there's some other skills, um, if I had chose the top route I could have gone Curse of Corrosion, so Magic Corrosion, uh, Magic Defense would be decreased. Um, for her, um, like, follower trait or the, her friendship um, trait, um, it's with Charlotte, so I, I have Charlotte, so I was able to get that. Um, then you also have another passive up here. Melted Ice, the damage done in battle with the enemy of a water attribute is 25%. Um, the amount of damage you're dealing is increased by 25%. So that's actually not even a bad one too. You know, I run Charlotte my team almost all the time. So, you know, there would be an increased damage here. So that's also not something bad to have. Um, and then you have the ultimate which shadow gathering um, again the translation is off so it's going to be a little bit difficult for me to tell you exactly what that is but um, equipment is nothing crazy I didn't really have anything else to put on her right now for the ruins I'm running the um, I'm running the hourglass uh, so that's the cooldown reduction um, these are just two extra slots I put in just to get the space here. Um, I may change and run this, but she doesn't really have an AOE skill, so I don't know if it makes sense for me to do that. But um, that was the video, guys. That was Catherine, the unit I just pulled. If you like the video, uh, share, like, subscribe, and thank you for watching.